They said, oh, you know, we just want to spend the year and we kind of want to capture these little moments and these little nuggets, like there's something so unique happening here. We we're like, uh, okay, all right, sure. Um, unprecedented now, I've heard, to give that level of yes. access yeah. um, and allow that level of intimacy. But for us at the moment, we thought, you know, we don't have anything to hide. Mari, her staff, those students brought us all along on a journey, their successes and their struggles. And you know, it mattered to Mari that she was on today, today, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr.'s day. When Lucy Laney's former leader went into the hallways of the Today Show this morning, she found a visual reminder of the shoulders she stands on in her fight for equality. It was amazing to do it today. Um, my husband told me before I came out here, he said you would make Martin Luther King Jr. very proud. And it, it just, I hope I would, I hope I do. Welcome back, hi baby. For years we have shared the story of Mari's leadership, of what she, her staff, and those students have had to overcome. Mm. Principal Fries Laban is here, thank you for joining us. Thank you. And today on Today, that story was shared with everyone, but today after today, she reminded us how present Dr. King is with her to this day. One thing that people don't know is that when um, kids are naughty, I make them rewrite the I Have a Dream speech. So I have copies ready for you and you can come in and you can have a seat and you can copy his I Have a Dream speech and you can channel his spirit because what he did to get us here is something that we can never forget and you obviously need a reminder of that. Perhaps it was the arc of the moral universe bending toward justice, towards change, that led to today being her day to share Lucy Laney on national TV. And I think about people who did amazing things like Mahatma Gandhi or Mother Teresa or Martin Luther King Jr. And I just think about the sacrifice that they made and he sacrificed until he could sacrifice no more. And it was all for other people. And so if somebody like him could do that, then somebody like me can continue to that every day. Beyond the meaning of it all was the grandness of it all. Mari soaked that up too. Jana, I even had a car this morning. I have so much makeup on, I had to take my contacts out because I, <laughs> I could hardly see the co-host. I just, I don't know. I just feel like Cinderella today. I really do. It's just, it's been fun. But maybe the most fun today for Mari is what has been the most fun for all the days since Lucy Laney let its stories be told. When I meet people, um, a lot of times like outside of North Minneapolis, like they're just like, oh my gosh, you know, once they watch the documentary. And so what I think happens is those of us that like live that world, we're like, yep, that's who we are. That's what we do. And we know it's complex and we know it's beautiful and our kids know that it's beautiful. Um, but the rest of the world now is getting a chance to see who we are. Thank you. All right. Thank you. If you want to check out Mari's whole appearance on the third hour of the Today Show, the link's on our website. You can check that out. And also, Love Them First, the documentary is still available for you to watch on YouTube.